Hi everybody, this is Cop Kitty and I am alive. Hello, it's been a while. According to my good friend Marcio from Rio de Janeiro, it's been more than 45 days and he's starting to have uh, Cop Kitty withdrawals. So I thought, well, so many people left messages on my channel. Like, thank you so much. Although I haven't um, made videos this uh, past months, I watched them all. And uh, if I didn't comment on your video, it's just because I was out of comments at that time. Because unfortunately, unfortunately, YouTube doesn't allow me to comment as much as I would like to. So, um, uh, so hi, how is everybody doing? I have wonderful news. I um, first and foremost, as uh, Violet Kitty would say, I have something to show you that absolutely blew my mind. Uh, right after I turned 29 this year on March, I began to freak out and say to myself, why I'm not doing what I like? What I'm just working and not having any fun and uh, having no time at all to spend 10% of the money I, ha I make. So, a uh, funny thing happened. I decided I decided to go into the Duran Duran website and check if they were on tour. And they were. And I was like, I always wanted, to, I'm a fan, so I, will, I always wanted to uh, see a Duran Duran concert, so I, I, I should. So I, I looked the closest um, location to Brazil and I found Orlando so since I had have already had uh, been to Orlando many times and I already know the drill of airplanes and airports and such I decided hey why not I can do this and I bought a ticket to the Duran Duran concert in March so uh, in, in about mid-April I was working a lot I was very busy but the uh, thought of uh, going to the concert kept me going. So I was like, all right, it's just a month away. And the concert was in May. So my sister decided to go with me because she decided I shouldn't travel alone. So I, uh, we made all the arrangements for a hotel and such to get to Orlando. So on March, on May 18th, here it is guys, I went to a Duran Duran concert. How awesome is that? <laughs> the reason why I haven't said anything before was that I was truly very busy um, to make a video, a decent video at least, and with all the um, MSN hacking thing I was pretty upset about the internet in a overall view. So my sister asked me, well, since we're, we're going to Orlando, can we go somewhere else that we don't know? So uh, I asked her, well, wh where would you like to go? And she says, um, you know, it was our first trip without our parents. Although I'm 29, I'm very scared of planes. So it was a good thing that she went there with me. So. I said, well, we could go to London because I, I, I've been there 13 years ago. I would love to see the city again. And it's a wonderful city for you to check out. So right after we went to Orlando, we went to London and had lots of fun. So this is my trip booklet where I keep all the dates and airplanes and such. Um, airplane tickets and, you know... I make little notes about uh, what the um, shopping was and how the food was and such, so it was really fun. And that's it, that's what I've been doing. 
I nearly drove myself out of my body during the Duran Duran concert. It was absolutely out of this world and it was wonderful. And we were in the second row, so we could see everything. And well, whoever likes Duran Duran, you know what I mean. And whoever doesn't, well, just, you know, be happy for me because it was such a great thing for me. And the fact that me and my sister um, traveled alone this, uh, this, this week in May, it was just one week from Saturday to Saturday, um, it really opened my mind and my, my head because I really realized that I wasn't really having any fun. So right after we got back from the trip, uh, one client of ours uh, said that we were, we were absent for too long and decided to ditch us. So one client was, but I, and I was like, okay, I don't need a client that cannot be alone for three days because it was a holiday here in Brazil. So we were absent just three days, weekdays. So I was like, I don't need this client to bug me during holidays. And then the week after that, <laughs> our second client said, you know what, we're going to interrupt our services for a little while. So uh, we will see you around October. But for now, we're going to interrupt our services. I was like, okay. So it was the perfect gap for me to take a deep breath and say, you know what, I'm enjoying my life right now. So next week I'm going to the countryside of uh, Minas Gerais, which is another state, to uh, historical cities, Ouro Preto, Tiradentes, and Monte Verde, which I'm probably going to make videos anyway, so you can expect that. I'm actually going to edit some of the uh, London stuff today, but I don't know, I don't really know how long it will take, so I won't promise anything. Um, so, <laughs> uh, all I can say, I had a wonderful time in London. The weather was really nice. I was uh, bursting with joy that I was back there after 13 years. And I won't take another 13 years to come back, that's for sure. So, I kept, I kept imagining... Uh, what well, what it would be like to make a like a gathering from YouTube and such, but then my sister was with me and it 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 wasn't really something that she would make. So I was like, okay, maybe next time I'm not as scared to fly alone, anyways, anymore. And uh, if you're wondering why I have polka dots all over me, it's just because my curtains are polka dotted holes and. That's why I have polka dots all over my face, so, but my, it's better than the sun on my face, so. I'm ne nearly on nine minutes, so maybe I'll make another video about, you know, ramblings and stuff. But it was so nice to make this video because I really wanted to tell you all where I've been all this time. So I've been um, clearing all my past and future to a new future, to a more enjoyable life, and uh, I'm really happy. <laughs> One of my dreams ever has been come true, has come true. So going to a Duran, con Duran Duran concert, wow. I might do that again, I don't know. <laughs> they still on tour. <laughs> all right, people, thank you so much for your messages. You're so also very kind to me. Thank you to the new subscribers and I'll talk to you later very soon. <laughs> Bye!